Anyang Sun Park, Chale Sun Yi. Hope that was close. That should be uh, Hope Girl Well. We'll see how uh, how well I did when you get the video. Hey, finished up your uh, Mercedes Benz uh, G63 AMG 6x6. I uh, just want to go ahead and throw a video up for you. Um, you asked for just basic uh, flashing headlights, uh, red and blue light bar, and flashing tail lights. But after I texted you a couple times, I went a little bit further. Uh, surprise. Um, you said you didn't mind. Uh, you just wanted the basics, so whatever I did to it was good. So that's that's what what's what we have here. Um, you did paint this, obviously you know that. But for the rest of the viewers and subscribers, uh, Sun Park did do the painting on this. Uh, the flat black, which looks really cool. Uh, he's going to do a uh, SWAT uh, diorama with it at a uh, at the night out. I think uh, National Night Out or whatever it's called uh, out there in California. So um, he's going to have this on a display. So anyway, uh, great paint job as always, son. Uh, there's probably a couple of places you'll need to touch up. I noticed a little place here on the roof that I kind of messed up, but it's flat black. I'll probably take care of it myself. But as you can see, the door still open. Uh, hood still opens. Also, your tailgate still opens. So we can close that up. Set the hood down. Um, I did add quite a bit of extra lighting for you. Like I said, I know you're not going to mind. Like I said, after discussing it in text, um, the battery is located up here under the hood. Um, to change that, you should be able just to take these two front screws out. And uh, you may have to take these two here out too that hold the running boards in the middle of the car together. And the battery will maybe come out the front. I can't promise you anything. Worst case, you just take the rest of the screws out uh, and it'll be fine. Um, what I did go and end up doing on this as well, I went ahead and uh, blacked out your windows, the rear windows. Even the rear rear window as well, uh, in the back, uh, just to kind of add more of a tactical look to it. I did not tint the front ones out. Uh, you'll see why here in just a minute. I want to leave those where you can see those, so see through. So anyway, uh, power switch right here in the back under the rear bumper. So we're going to turn that on. And I put you uh, some red and blue grill strobe or a red and blue grill strobe in. Uh, flashing headlights, of course, that we talked about. You see those grill strobes a little bit better there. Of course, red and blue uh, rooftop light bar. Went ahead and added a uh, MDT in the interior and a, an interior work light. You can see those, which is why I did not tint out the uh, front windows. You can see inside. A little bit better and the rear I put a uh, traffic advisor type bar in with red and blues a few different patterns with it looks really cool there you can see it uh, red on the tips blues in the center looks really neat in person I like the three different patterns to that and then of course strobe tail lights They're a steady flash off on, strobe off on. I don't know why. Well, I do know why because my camera stinks. But, you know, and, uh, the camera's making them look a lot more weird. But they are a steady uh, strobe flash. Uh, nothing else on this side. Of course, you can see your light bar still. And then back to the front. Again, uh, strobes and uh, flashing headlights. And you mentioned something about having a uh, choco pie, like the favorite snack of Korea, uh, up here. And I didn't, I don't have one, so I guess I have to wait for you to send me some. Maybe I'll put some in the next video. But the choco pie is good, tasty, uh, tasty treat. I see why it's the favorite in Korea because it's the favorite at my workbench. So anyway, uh, that will do it. Um, let me know what you think of the car, and I'll get it shipped it uh, shipped out to you as soon as possible. Anyang.